Well, today the Mall of America is going red for women. The American Heart Association is holding a health expo featuring some fun events focusing on heart health. Right now, Rachel Slavic is at Mall of America at the Rotunda with more. Hi, Rachel. Good morning, Mike and Ellie. Yes, in addition to the shopping today, you can get some very important information about heart health with the Go Red Health Expo. In addition to learning about CPR and a doggy fashion show, one of the most important parts of heart health is what we eat. And right now we have Carl Benson with Cooks of Crocus Hill here to talk to us. So if we are thinking about our health and the foods we eat, what are some key foods that you need to be incorporating into your diet? It's, we all know, right? It's uh, more fruits and vegetables, more big green, big green leafy vegetables, um, legumes, dried, dried beans and chickpeas and that kind of thing. Um, more white meat as opposed to red meat, so fish and chicken. And you want to skew your diet, if you will, away from protein and more into fresh fruits and vegetables. So today we're talking fresh fruits and vegetables. Yeah, what will you be making here? Because I think of fruits and vegetables and I just think, oh, I'll eat an orange, but you have some very tasty recipes. Yes, uh, and they're going to demo those today here as well. Um, a lot of things that we hear at cooks are that during the winter time there's just nothing to be inspired by and i'd say absolutely disagreed right now is primo uh, citrus season and so in this little jar we have uh, grapefruit cara cara oranges and navel oranges super super sweet super zesty super um a lot of juice in there. So the other piece is to make a vinaigrette from scratch. So Which is better than the dressing or what you buy in the better. store. Way, and it's very better. easy. How easy is that to make? There's four ingredients in a vinaigrette. There's mustard, there's olive oil, there's shallot if you're making a traditional French vinaigrette, and then there's an acid, so an acid like a vinegar. So those four things, salt and pepper. And then anything you do to sort of elevate that, you can use... Um, you can use citrus juice, you can use lemon juice instead of the acid. So in this case here, in this particular dressing, um, it's olive oil, it's vinegar, it's lemon juice, it's mustard. There's a little bit of shallot in there and then a little bit of honey. Well, it all sounds so great, and you mix it all together and do a great salad, and people can come out and check out the cooking demonstrations yep. here at the Go Red Health Expo. It goes from 11 to 4 today here at the Mall of America Rotunda. And in the next half hour, I teased a little bit about a doggy fashion show. That's coming up for you in the next half hour. We'll tell you how that ties into Heart Health. All right, Mike Rachel, Natalie. thank you. And actually, the, yeah. the human fashion show is being right. emceed by our very own Kylie Burse. So another reason to go out there and check things out. It should be really cool, too. I got a preview of some of the looks. It's, it's really fun. So Rotunda at Mall of America for that. Nearly 460,000 women die each year from heart disease, but we're going to change that. Yeah, that's why the American Heart Association is holding a health expo today to bring awareness to this problem in a fun way. And Rachel Slavic joins us live now from the Mall of America with some four-legged friends and what you can expect later today. Hi, Rachel. Hi, Mike and Ellie. Yes, they are definitely incorporating the fun here at the Go Red Heart Health Expo. We have some special guests here. We've got the dogs behind, which I was telling you about. We have Tolstoy here who's walking by us. We have Kaylee here. And then right behind is Mia. And you're just getting a little preview of the fashion show. I'm told more costumes will come out a little later. We have Elizabeth Warmka here to talk to us with the American Heart Association. So how do dogs tie into heart health? Yes, uh, we partnered with the North Star Therapy Dogs. And part of it is because the American Heart Association has issued a statement that owning a dog is actually good for your heart health. It reduces your stress and it relaxes you and it gets you more active. So what can we expect to see with the dogs today? Yes, we've got a dog fashion show. It'll be happening at 1 and then again at 3. And uh, we'll see the dogs in their red outfits and we'll have a lot of health tips as well as you can learn dog CPR down in the L.L. Bean Court as well as human CPR. And lots of fun things happening today. Uh, we got healthy cooking demos and blood pressure screening. And so just a really a lot of good information for people. We've been out here doing this for about 8 years. You know, when we're talking about a heart health, I feel like a lot of these things, healthy eating, exercise is something that we hear all the time and sometimes it's not always something we apply to our daily lives. Why why is an expo like this so important to getting that message out there? I think it's just a good reminder for people, as well as we have a lot of tips on how to make it easy in your life. Um, you know, with our cooking demos, as you guys showed earlier this morning, it can be as easy as making like a four ingredient vinaigrette to your salad. Um, and CPR, you can learn it here in 15 minutes. 15 minutes and you could save somebody's life. It could be your pet, it could be your mother. And so um, these are just tips that people can learn and it's, it's really easier than people think. All right, thank you so much, Elizabeth. Really appreciate it. And if you want to do head down here, we're at the Mall of America, the Rotunda. It goes from a 11 to 4 today, and it is free. So stop by, and you can see these lovely dogs. These are some special dogs. Um, I can't show you this on TV, but one of them was actually singing along with the song Hallelujah. What? They're impressive. What? So you just have to come down and see for yourself. <laughs> That's very cool. Rachel, thank you.